Hello, and welcome back to GSC 204, Entrepreneurship and Innovation. This is week eight. We're going to be doing revision. We're going to revise all we've done over the past. Well, we're going to answer questions though. Now this class, what we're going to do is, in the class itself, we will go over everything we've done. But for this video, I'm going to put out certain class questions for you to answer when we come into the class on. Thursday. Now the focus is questions from the discussion forum and the general questions as well that you may have. Um, these are your intended learning outcomes. Hopefully you can answer the questions from discussion forum and also general questions. Now the first class activity we will do is entrepreneurship is. So you will describe what entrepreneurship is from your own perspective and also from your own practical angle. I want to know what your understanding of entrepreneurship is. So that is what we'll be answering in the class. The next activity, next question is, the Nigerian business environment can make or break a business. Critically discuss this statement, stating the positive and negative effects of the Nigerian business, business environment, and how businesses can mitigate the risk that comes with it. Now, also, I wanted to discuss how can an entrepreneur, how an entrepreneur can use technology to promote and operate his or her business effectively, keeping in mind the current business environment. What do you think? How can they actually use technology to their advantage? Then lastly, in what ways can you create value for your company through social entrepreneurship? Now, these are the questions we're going to take in the class. So I would like to actually go through them and then we'll discuss it in class. Um, come with your questions, anything, any issues you have, we'll discuss them, we'll go over them. So um, the class, the course has nine modules, so please go through all the modules. And then surely the key salient points I took over during the course, that will help you in your examinations. So um, thank you very much. Good luck in your exams. And please come with your questions and then we'll answer them effectively. Take care.